Pisces, Kaisha here. Thank you so much for joining me on my channel, The Butterfly Effect Tarot. Huge shout out to my day ones, my foundation subscribers, all of my new subscribers. Thank you. You are appreciated. And if you're checking me out for the first time and this reading resonates with you or I as a reader resonate with you, I encourage you to please share, like, and of course, don't be shy, subscribe. Okay, Pisces, this is a general energy check. Not going to resonate with all of you, so take what resonates and discard the rest. Don't try to force shit to fit. It'll only confuse your ass, okay? Nobody wants that. I don't want that. Spirit doesn't want that, okay? Your ancestors don't want that, so you know your energy. You know your story. Uh, I'm reading it like it's happening now because past, present, future, it's all happening now. So you put the energy where it goes, okay, on the timeline. Uh, so we're just going to see what's going on with you, Pisces, okay? And of course, provide some um, invaluable advice from Spirit, right? So I just want to thank all of you for your good karma donations. For those who hit me up on the live tarot line, your harmonic wave, thank you. Thank you so much. Uh, my group has been filling up Woke and Woke Mom. Thank you. I appreciate the love and the support. If that is something you'd be interested in, it is a, a group for specific types of frequencies. It's not for everybody. <laughs> okay, so once you check out like a reading that I, I like to sample readings from that, um, that community on Saturdays, I do a live for them. So and I just share it with everyone. So if that's the kind of energy that you're about, then that group is, is a, it's a nice spot to be in, okay? Because that's what's up over there. So the link is in the description box. Also, I just want to thank all of you for keeping my ass busy with these personal bookings. I've been booked out the wazoo. <laughs> and I like it. I like it. Thank you. I like to be productive, right? So you just allow me to share my gifts and just do what I'm doing and be who I am. So thank you. I appreciate that. Okay, let's see what we got here. Spirit, thank you for your clear and concise messages. I'm here and I understand them. So today I was guided to play a little bit of music in the background. So I'm sure that Spirit wants to convey some messages with music. I know me personally, Spirit always is always speaking to me through music. So, okay, you see cards are falling already. I'm going to take them. Okay, you have Six of Cups. Six of Cups. And you have Ace of Coins in reverse, though. Okay. Hmm. Okay. What else do we have, Spirit? What else do you have? What else do you have for the beautiful Pisces collective? Pisces, I feel like you you finally let something go. Okay, you got ten of coins. Yes, yes, yes. I feel like you finally let something go that was not. I feel like it's not what you thought it was going to be or maybe once upon a time it was wish fulfillment for you and it, and it turned out not to be, right? It's like a dream that turned into a nightmare. I feel like you finally healed from that. Mm -hmm. Can I get one more, Spirit? Can I get one more? Some of you could have, uh, you finally healed from a relationship that turned out to be, oh, look at this. You got 10 of coins and you got the star. This is beautiful. So someone in this collective, you could have been in a situation where someone where money was running. They had money. That wasn't an issue, but there was no real genuine happiness in the relationship. I feel like there was someone was greedy. I feel like someone was unhappy, like miserable. Someone could have ran off with someone else. You know, they could have fell for fool's gold or some of you could have feel like you fell for fool's gold because all was not what it seemed with somebody you know they may have made it painted this picture that something was the way it really wasn't right i'm a great person i love you and take care of you and then when you got them or you got with them it turned out to be a fucking nightmare right because whoever you were dealing with there's something to do with money this person could have got with you for money pisces or looked at you as money bags money bags money bags or felt like they could get something, gain some kind of benefit from you, from being with you or being attached to you or tied to you, I feel like you finally healed from that. And that's good. That's good. I'm going to look into this some more. So what is this um, Six of Cups and Ace of Coins in reverse? What is that? What is that? What is this about? Mm -hmm. Pisces, I feel like someone in the beginning may have looked like they were down for the count, right? Or they're down for the cut. You know, and, and they would help you. And, and I feel like maybe this person did help you at first, but then after 
It's like they were just doing enough to make you or lead you to believe that they had your back. And then after you realize that it really wasn't even like that. Mm -mm. That somebody was out for something else. So I feel like someone pretended to really care about you, but they really didn't. They just wanted something from you. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I look at this. Sierra promise just came on. Someone could have promised you something and they were um, broken promises or hoop dreams, right? But look at this here too. You have Wheel of Fortune and this is 10. Can you see this at the bottom? It's a 10. So this is a cycle that is over and that's absolutely awesome. I, I also feel like this is, this was supposed to happen. You know, this was a part of your destiny. You were supposed to meet this person. You were supposed to go through what you went through with them. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and there's always a lesson in that, right? Okay, there's too much cards I need to come up. So where can I get some more for Six of Cups and Ace of Coins in reverse? So it's not a loss, Pisces. It's a lesson. Yeah, look at this. Three of Swords. Yeah, someone broke your heart. Someone lied to you, promised you something they could have promised. They would never leave you or they would always be there for you. They'd always have your back and they were a damn liar. Yes, they were. Yeah. The dream turned out to be a nightmare. Can I, um, yeah. Pisces, you could have had a, an attitude with this person like, there's nothing I wouldn't do for you. Like, you could have been so in love with this person. That's why it, it completely broke your heart, what they did. Because I feel like you had genuine love for this person, right? Overflowing, my cup runneth over with this person, like, What's mine is yours. Whatever I have, I give to you. If you need something, I'm, I got you. And if I don't have it, I will find it. Like it was that kind of love with somebody. And they stabbed you in your back. They deceived you. Yeah. They broke your heart, brought third parties in, cheated on you. And it sucks. It really does. But it, you were supposed to learn this lesson. And this person was contracted to teach it to you. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can I get one more spur? Yeah, yeah. Prince of Wands, yes. This person was immature, but then again, Pisces, so were you. You could have gotten with this person when you were young. Mm hmm Or when you were younger. Not really uh, understanding certain things about relationships yet or what you even really want in a relationship or who you really are, right? You could have had some ideology about something and realized that uh, times have changed, you know? Mm -hmm. You know, you could have fell for the someone who was charming and fun and funny and, and all of that, right? For some of you, this is, I'm speaking to someone from the LGBTQ plus two. Is that what it is now? My daughter's been educating me. It's going to be someone in, in that community. Hmm. Okay. Let me see what this is. So what's this Wheel of Fortune? What's the Wheel of Fortune? Can I get one on the Wheel of Fortune? But this cycle is over, Pisces, which is awesome, right? Look at this. King of Cups in reverse. Yeah. You were supposed to go through this with this person who did not give you their cup. They were just about for about what was in yours and what you can get, give them, All right? This is someone who could blame you, have blamed you for stuff. Someone who had a bad temper, someone who was two-faced, right? Someone who was sneaky, lie to you, deceive you, yeah. This is also spirit letting you know that the wheel has turned on this Time has passed, enough time has passed, and this is over now, Pisces? Yeah. Yeah. All, all this injustice and, and ruin, right? Someone could have tried to ruin your life, or someone could have hurt you so bad, you felt like it, they ruined your life. Mm-hmm. Well, this is over. Spirit, so can I get one on um, Three of Swords? Can I get one on Three of Swords? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, wow. Three of swords, three of cups in reverse. Wow. <sighs> Fuck, Pisces. I know. 
I know, I know, baby, I know. Pisces, without a shadow of a doubt, this person was just being for the streets. Whoever this person was, right? Right? What do you have on? John Legend and Mooney Long, honey, okay? Yeah, this person was going around giving their honey to everybody, right? Easily stuck to other people. Yeah. Yeah. You're finally healing from this though, Pisces. That's good. That's really good. Spirit, can I get one on this Prince of Wands? Yeah. Someone liked to party, right? They were fun. They like to have a good time. They like to go partying. They like to drink. Someone could have had a bit of a drinking problem. The world, look at this. Yeah. Yeah. The cycle is over, Pisces. That's really good, right? Things have changed because you've changed. I feel like you're changing. Spirit, can I get one more on the world? What is this world here? Let me see this. What is this world? Yeah. Someone could have made you feel like they wanted a new beginning with you, but I, I feel like you just, you're finally over wanting a new beginning with this, with this particular person, right? You could have been hoping that things would get better with them and things would change. I feel like you're over that now. And I, I feel like it's so funny because I just did the Scorpio reading and it was kind of similar. Maybe this is a theme of letting go and releasing the past. But I, I don't feel like anger or animosity towards anyone. I feel like it's done. I just, I'm just moving forward with shit being done, right? I don't, I'm not stressing over this anymore. I'm not holding on to it. I'm not holding on to you. It's done and okay. Mm hmm. Yeah, I feel like Pisces, you are, you're fighting for a new world for yourself, which is you're fighting with weapons of determination, loyalty, self-discovery, self-confidence, self-love. I feel like this is what you're fighting with now for yourself, for your new, this new chapter. You're fighting for fulfillment. Yeah. Yeah. You're fighting for your just reward, rewards, for all your hard work. You're fighting for your dreams. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah, that ultimate change. And you're willing to put in what you need to put in to get to where you want to go and create the life that you know you deserve. Some of you, this is a relationship. You know you deserve a better relationship. So you're fighting the urge of going back and talking to people who you know ain't shit. And been showing you nothing but bullshit. Right? Once upon a time when you would cave and let some people back in. And you're not doing that anymore. You're fighting, the, you're fighting the urge. And I feel it. I feel like someone, you have this soft spot or you had a soft spot for someone. But mm -mm. <laughs> it's not soft anymore. No. Or it's not as soft as it used to be. Accountability. I'm hearing accountability. Some of you, Pisces, you are... You are learning to hold people accountable for their actions. It's so funny. I got the exact same thing for um, Scorpio. Someone may have Scorpio in their chart or you're dealing with a Scorpio or. But it's just the injustices, the unfair treatment that you got from somebody or from someone's. Because for some of you, it was friends that broke your heart. Who is this? Someone you were dealing with two other females that broke your heart. Mm hmm talked about you dogged you out broke your heart blamed you for shit lied on you talked shit about you very malicious and it broke your heart and you're learning to just you know what i deserve better in my life and that's what i'm gonna go towards and if i have to let go of this stuff then that's what i have to do you're healing from this and you're so, I love that you're so determined to have a better life for yourself and this chapter to have different things. You want fulfillment, you want satisfaction, you want equal reciprocity, you want to be recognized, which means, and it's not like, oh, look at me. It's, you want people to see you. You want people to see you. You want people to see you, Pisces. Mm -hmm. See you on all levels. This is not, you don't want no surface um, relationships with people anymore. It's depth. They have to meet you uh, as deep as you are. Mm-hmm. Wow. 
Okay, I, I'm here for that. I'm here for that. Okay, so let's see, you have 10 of coins. This is great. You're focusing on a solid, stable foundation for yourself. Mm -hmm. if, you are in a, if you have a family or in a relationship already, that's what you're building towards. 100%, that's what you're building towards. Spirit, what is this? Can I get some more on, use this deck. Can I get some more on 10 of coins, please? Thank you. Can I get some more on this 10 of coins? Yeah. I keep hearing inheritance or um, windfall, windfall Pisces. You could be getting an inheritance or you could be getting a windfall of money. Go play the lottery. Mm -hmm. But whatever money is coming in, it is going to bring stability and security and, and a solidarity to your life, to what you're building. Someone, uh, you could have your own business. Whatever extra money that is coming to, into, into you, <laughs> In for you, you will be investing or you will be starting something new. Yeah. Yeah. Nine of swords. Someone's worried about money. Yeah. Yeah, they are. Someone's worried about, look at this empress. Look at this. You see that? Now someone's having nightmares because life is not good for them and they don't have a solid, stable foundation like they would have with you. And now they're worried. Pisces, yeah. Oh yes, they are. Yeah, oh yeah, yeah, eight of, holy. Nine of swords, eight of swords. Someone be having nightmares because you're doing so good. Mm-hmm. Because you moved on in your life. You're taking care of yourself. You're focusing on you and what you need to do for yourself. If you have children, you're focusing on your child or your children. You ain't worried about this person in the past anymore. You have healed quite nicely, actually. Mm -hmm. And they stressed, okay? Full-blown stress, not sleeping. Whoever this is, they are not sleeping. They just stay up and they worry. Mm-hmm. They worry about you moving on. If you've gotten into a relationship with somebody else, they're worried. <laughs> they have a lot of anxiety over the fact that you are building a solid, stable foundation without their ass. You're doing it with somebody else. Yeah. If you are single, Pisces, this person is worried. About <laughs> they have a lot of anxiety over the fact that you're doing so well without them. If you could have been doing well with them and when they were gone, you're doing even better. This person has a lot of anxiety about that because no longer are you, I'll do anything for you. I got your back. I'll always take care of you. I'll always be there for you. Now you're on bitch. You need to have your money up because guess what? I'm good over here. I've been taking care of my shit. While you're out blowing all your money on drinks, <laughs> buying rounds from the, from the bar for people, spending money on third parties, Paying for hotel rooms and paying for dinner and acting, trying to pose off and pop style on people. <laughs> While you were busy doing that, I was over here stacking my money and investing in shit and planting seeds because I have bigger plans for my life. Mm -hmm. Now somebody's stressed. Mm -hmm. A lot of anxiety here. Spare, can I get one more, please? And it's so messed up, too, because this person has a lot of anxiety, Pisces, because you're doing so well, right? Yeah. Look at this, the fool. Right? You separated, you left them. They, For some of you, this person left you because they thought the grass was greener on the other side. And it fucking wasn't. Because it doesn't matter what side of the fence you're on, you still have to put in that work to get that grass green. Don't get it twisted. Okay? So you said, okay. You took your time, you healed. And this is not a little simple thing either, Pisces. Three of Swords, this grief, heartbreak. You felt like someone stabbed you in your heart or ripped your heart out of your chest. Some people die from heartbreak, you know. It's like a real syndrome. This is how this person made you feel. And it took you a long time to heal from this, but you're here now. You bossed up. You're moving forward in your life. You've taken that leap of faith. 
to do what you need to do to better your life. This goes back to this being determined and loyal and fighting for this new chapter, this new cycle in your life. Good for you. And this person sees you. They be watching your ass. Yes. Oh, yes, they are. Spirit, can I get one on this nine of swords? On this nice, somebody is watching you build a very stable, a very solid foundation for yourself, either by yourself or with somebody else. And when I say they're crying, this is someone who they'll let go in their car and cry, think about it and cry. Someone is hiding and crying. Someone has a lot of anxiety about this in their head. Like they can't stop thinking about it. You're the first thing they think about when they get up. You're the last thing they think about when they go to their bed. Stress. Because you took up, you bet on yourself mm -hmm. and you let it go and you healed and you healed quite nicely. Yes. Mm -hmm. Spirit, can I get one on Nine of Swords? What is this Nine of Swords about? Spirit said wrong there. Okay. What is this Nine of Swords about? Yeah. Someone never thought that you would be able to do this. And it's not even like they thought that you were uh, incapable of doing this. They never thought that you would do this without them. So I feel like this low-key arrogance with someone, like you're always going to be waiting for me. I am your world. And they realized that no, they fucking weren't. <laughs> no, they weren't. Wow. Look at this. Ten of Cups. <laughs> Wendy Ross. Pisces. Do you see this? Somebody been worried, stressed out that you moved on and you're happy. As some of you, this is someone who's just upset at the fact that you're single, sexy, and free and can manage your life, can take care of your kids on your own, and you're doing great. You have options. You're enjoying your life. Mm -hmm. You are your own ten of cups. But someone legit in this, whoever this is, they are stressed, full of anxiety, losing sleep. For those of you that have gotten into a relationship with someone else, and it's a real genuine connection. Someone is losing sleep over this because they never thought with their arrogant ass that you would be able to do that or you really would move on and leave them. Someone never thought you would heal. You would always be low-key waiting for them and they could just come back in whenever they wanted. Hmm. They got a rude fucking awakening now, didn't they, Pisces? <laughs> Someone thought when they were good and ready, they can just saunter casually come back into your life. Like, oh, Pisces, what's up? Let's try this again. I'm broke. I need some money. Can you take care of this for me? No, Pisces, you ain't even doing that. You ain't even about that life anymore. Sorry, honey. Huh? Everybody has to take care of themselves now. We're all adults around here. Someone in this collective, you were dealing with someone. It was like a dynamic that was very imbalanced. That's where the injustice came from because it was like you were dealing with your own child. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Spirit, can I get one on the Empress, please? Can I get one on the Empress? You bossed all the way up to Pisces. Yes, you did. And now your focus, your priority is your happiness and what you're doing for yourself. And you take care of you. Yeah, you do. And this person, you want to know another thing too? They are stressed over the... This is someone who remembers how good you took care of them, Pisces. Yeah. And now that they don't have it and now that they see someone else getting it or now that they see that you're just pouring all that energy back into yourself, they miss it. And they know that they would never get an opportunity to get that or be that way with you again. I would be stressed too. Yeah, I would. I would be losing sleep too. Mm -hmm. This is a classic case of you never know what you have until it's gone. Look at this, the Knight of Wands. Yeah. Yeah. This Knight of Wands is looking at this Empress or this Emperor like you a whole fucking boss over here and I'm not even ready for you. They still can't even, as much as they want to, they cannot provide what you are ready for and who you are. They can't meet you there. Mentally, emotionally, spiritually, physically, they're not even ready yet. They want to be, but they're not. Right? Because an Emperor and an Empress is not going to go for a night. Mm-hmm. That's like an adult who wants to be with a teenager. Why? Right? Right? Someone like, to, you're in your, almost well into your 50s and you want to talk to someone who's 21, 22, 25. Yeah, they could be very, um, very mature, but still they're not mature enough. Mm-hmm. Wow. Spirit, can I get one on Eight of Swords? Can I get one on Eight of Swords? Wow, 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 wow. <laughs> For someone 
this collective, someone is upset at the fact that you you are with someone younger than them. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> what I just heard. I just heard the Jennifer Lopez effect, right? She gets married, it doesn't work out, and then she meets some young blood, right? <laughs> She goes with some young buck. Yes. And he, he rocks her world until she gets tired of him. Yeah. So someone is stressed out and has anxiety over the fact that you attract the young bloods, right? You look good. Masculine or feminine. Yes. Mm -hmm. And you're having a good time living your best life. Someone's upset about that. Yeah, look at this. Now they're stressed over the fact that they put you in third parties. Oh, yeah. Someone is, I feel like they're really sorry about, it's not even sorry, it's regret. They regret what they did. They regret how they hurt you. They regret that they um, made you an option. Yes. Hmm. All those nights, Pisces, when you were worried about what they were doing and, and, and stressed out about their behavior towards you and if they're being faithful because they weren't. And you're a water sign, so you're very intuitive. If you got a bad feeling, it was probably right. You see how the shoe, the, the, not even the shoe, where is it? You see how the wheel is always turning. You're at the top, they're at the bottom now. Mm -hmm. You know what I just heard? I ain't worried about nothing. Nigga, I ain't worried about nothing, right? Pisces, you ain't worried about nothing now. Mm -mm. You don't have any worries. You have faith. You have faith now. You're not worrying. The same energy that you used to put into worry about them, you put it into yourself to believe that you can have a better life and you can be in a better relationship. And that's exactly what the fuck you manifested. Good for you. Good for you. Now they're stressed. Now they're worried about how they treated you. Mm -hmm. Now they're sorry that they did that to you, that they cheated on you repeatedly, that they wanted to be for the streets, right? Look at this. Lauren Hill, X Factor. I cannot make this up. <laughs> Spirit, yes, honey, yes. Do you see this? X Factor, Lauren Hill. Right? It could have all been so simple, but they rather make it hard. Mm hmm Right? Who did you have to be to get some res equal reciprocity from this person? Who did you have to be for them to respect you and treat you with love and kindness and, and generosity and compassion the way how you were with them? Hmm? You realize you didn't have to be no one, just yourself. Yeah? Just your beautiful divine self. And they see that. Oh, they see that. Don't get it twisted. They do. Hmm. Pisces, someone's behavior backfired on them. Yes, it did. And all those nights that they had you stressed out, look at this. Wow. Stressed out, depressed, full of anxiety because of the way how they were dealing with you or the way how they weren't dealing with you, but they should have been. The shoe is completely on the other foot. Now, this is, I should name this, this um, how the tables have turned, right? Because look at this, like I said, some of you, you are in a brand new relationship with somebody. For some of you, you're in a relationship with someone who's younger. Mm -hmm. And they're jealous, jealous. <laughs> yes, they are. Mm -hmm. That you can still pull the young bloods because you got it. You got it like that. Mm -hmm. Look at this. Do you see this, the fool and the lovers? Some of you, you moved on and moved up into a relationship, a real relationship, a genuine connection with a true soulmate. Mm -hmm. No more of this karmic shit. Okay? Mm -mm. And someone is freaking out going out of their mind. <laughs> They've lost their mind. They're losing sleep. <laughs> Someone's not eating. Wow. Because you're doing the damn thing and you're doing it big damn. Mm -hmm. You're in a whole relationship with somebody. Wow. Someone said, I'm with a real man. Right? <laughs> Right? No more of this. You're not really ready. You want to be ready, but you're not really ready yet. <laughs> no more of that. Emperor meets Empress. That's what you're on, Pisces. Good for you. 
Oh my. It's messed up though because someone is very upset at the fact that you're happy. They never thought that you would be. They never thought that you would get over them in their arrogance. Yeah. Wow. Spirit, can I get some on the star? What is the star here? Right? This is healing. This is wholeness. This is clarity, Pisces. Hi. This is you. Mm -hmm. Oh, yes. This is walking by faith, not by sight. This is true fulfillment. That's what you were fighting for. That's what you got. Mm -hmm. Fulfillment from the inside out. Mm -hmm. This is happiness. This is pleasure. Right? A lot of you, you're here, you're, you're striving to live the best life. Live your best life by being your best self. That's awesome. Spirit, can I get some on the star, please? Look at this. Ten of Wands. I feel like now you see clearly the burdens that people put on you, uh, that you allowed others to put on you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You've healed from that. For people that acted like they were for you, but really they were just about what they could get from you. Yeah. Queen of Wands. There you are. Mm -hmm. Managing your life. Multitasking like a motherfucker. Making friends. Making new connections. Mm -hmm. Walking in your power. Someone looks really good. I like that. You know what it is? You may find that you're retracting. Like if you go somewhere, people are staring at you or you may be getting attention. I don't even feel like this is attention intentional. Like you're putting yourself together to get attention from people. I think that I feel like this is just because you are in this empress energy of taking care of yourself, divine feminine energy. It shows, right? Someone you are, you could have changed your hair color. I feel like your skin is glowing. You could be doing a new skin regimen. Someone could be spending more time out in the sun. Yes, getting that vitamin D. Someone is working on their chakra, specifically your root chakra. Yes, very much connected, very much tapped in. Mm -hmm. Someone, is, is it plants? You're planting or you're using some kind of herb or something or drinking some kind of teas. Yeah. But you are, you're doing things that uh, allow you to feel fulfilled and elevated from the inside out and it shows. And people are attracted to that. Mm-hmm. People can recognize, they see that you're, you look like someone who takes care of themselves. That's what it is. You want to hear a joke? Nicki Minaj, Moment for Life just came on. <laughs> Star. Mm -hmm. Doesn't mean you're alive. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's what it is. If Pisces, you're not worried about anybody anymore. Okay, you're about living your best life. You're about enjoying the moments that you have in your life now. You're not wasting time, energy, stressing over anybody anymore. No, you're not. Especially people that were a burden to you in the past. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I'm blessed. No, I'm not lucky. I'm blessed. Yes, you know that you're blessed. And you're walking in it. You own it. Highly favored are here. Highly favored. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Five of swords. Yeah. You see clearly people that brought drama and conflict and obstacles and arguments into your life, that brought burdens and blockages. You see them clearly. Mm hmm Yeah. Yeah. And this is a moment to celebrate. Look how far you came. Look what you've been through, Pisces. Look at this. You healed from this. Broken home, broken relationships, you healed from this. All of this, all of this pain, all of this hurt, all of this suffering. Someone in this collective, you were suffering in silence. Going around acting like things were okay and they're going to get better in your relationship, but it takes two. And the person you were with, they've been on some fuckery. Yeah, they weren't trying to fix nothing with you. No, they were just about using you for whatever they could get. Now the shoe is on the other foot. Mm-hmm. Wow. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah. yeah. Spirit, can I get one on Ten of Wands? Can I get one on Ten of Wands? You overcame so much. Go we'll celebrate, Pisces. Good for you. Look at this. Queen of Coins. I can't make this up. Okay? Yeah. 
You see clearly people who were burdens and they were using you for your stability and your security. Pisces, I need a place to live. I need a place to stay. Can I use your car? Mm -hmm. Can you help me out with this bill? Can I borrow some money? Can you take care of this for me? I got you next week and next week it never comes. You see who is using you. So where can I get one on Queen of Wands? Yeah. You've healed from that. Yeah. Temperance in reverse. You lost your patience with these people. You got tired of waiting for someone to grow up and get it and change. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yes, you did. All right. You got tired of someone being a drunk or an alcoholic and having outbursts when they're drunk or acting a fool. Someone has collected you would go out with someone and when they got drunk, they would hit on everybody. And if you were just so tired of it. You were so embarrassed. Right? They would just be trying to flirt with other people in front of you. And especially when they got some liquor in them, it was ten times worse. Oh, boy. Mm-hmm. Five of Swords. You got Five of Swords clarified by Five of Swords. This person was drama. Mm-hmm. Conflict. Problems. Messy, messy, messy person you were dealing with. Mm-hmm. Five of Swords clarified by Five of Swords. Yes, Look at this, man. Degrading. I keep being drawn to degrading, right? No, man. No, 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 no. Spirit, can I get one on four of wands in reverse? You healed from this. I feel like, Pisces, you realize the difference between quality over quantity as well. It's not just enough now that you are in a relationship with someone. You have to be in a good relationship. It doesn't matter how long you've been with someone. It's about the quality of the relationship, right? You realize the difference between that now. Can I get one on four of wands in reverse, please? Yeah. Ace of swords. I can't make this up. Oh, you see clearly that your ass was not supposed to be with somebody. <laughs> mm -hmm. As much as you love them, as much as you wanted them, you realize that someone's ass was not good for you. Mm -mm. And you had to let that go. It wasn't a good idea to have them around. It wasn't a good idea to let them into your life. You could have a child or children with this person. It still wasn't a good idea to have any type of family with them. Okay? You learned. You healed. You moved on. Very good, Pisces. Very good. Mm -hmm. Someone was abusive as well. Yes. They were very abusive. They had a bad temper. Mm-hmm. And get upset and think that they could come try to slap you around because whatever the fuck's going on with them. No, 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 no. Ain't nobody doing any of that stuff. That's not okay. You lost your patience, right? Look at this. Beyonce, you can't break my soul. They can't break your soul. They couldn't. They tried, but they couldn't. Mm-hmm. Pisces, I'm so proud of you. Someone tried to break you down, Okay. And they tried to go through your heart. They, yeah, they tried to do it with their emotions, right? Emotional manipulation. They tried to break you down by breaking your heart. Right? And that didn't work. Mm -mm, that didn't work. Someone tried to break you down, keep it, preventing you from sleeping and taking care of yourself. Now that's what all you do is take care of you. Mm -hmm. And now somebody's stressed. Well, 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 Spirit, can I get some last words of guidance and advice for the beautiful Piscean Collective? This is already 40 minutes. Oh, my goodness. I didn't know it was going to be so long. Wow. Wow. Look at, oh, my goodness. You know what? I'm going to put this back because I got this for Scorpio. If it comes out again, then I'll take it. But I'm going to do, I need to do a good shuffle. And the Heartbreak card wanted to come out in reverse, so... Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Spirit, what last words of guidance and advice do you have for the beautiful Piscean Collective? Okay. Let's see. Fourth chakra, Archangel. Raphael, your heart chakra is not blocked anymore because of this person and their foolishness. It's wide open. You've done a lot of work on yourself. Pat yourself on the back. Brush, brush your shoulders off. Go celebrate. You deserve this. Okay, 
You've done a lot of work. And what I like too is that you, you worked with the universe, right? Look at you. Some of you are working with Archangel Raphael. You didn't even realize it. Working with your guides, your angels, your lifted ancestors. The most high, of course. Mm-hmm. This is what helped you to heal and open your heart. This person wanted you to be cold and callous and calculated like them. You didn't. You didn't lower your vibration to meet them and match them in their reality. You said, fuck that, I'm out of here. I'm better than this. So I'm going to strive for better in my life. You got to go. Mm -hmm. Good for you. Good for you, Pisces. Aww. Okay, Spirit says that's enough. That's enough. <laughs> Pisces, I just want to personally say I'm so happy and proud of you. Like This is very inspiring because someone really tried to break you down through your heart right someone tried to really like rip your heart out of your chest and then they had the gall and the idosity to think that they can just come back in whenever they want because you would never live without them and you found it in your heart to move forward so you could have chosen to do this to lower your vibration and keep playing stupidness and going on on this fuckery with this person and you didn't you said i'm gonna do better for myself and i'm gonna be a better person and that's what you did. You chose the light. And I think that's absolutely beautiful. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm done now. I'm done. Okay? Bye.